Hi, I'm going to try to explain uh, the X, Y, and Z axis for the 2.0 GUI. Uh, here's just a basic quad setup with forward, uh, the gimbal tray, and the right axis always pointing to the right. This is from the top looking down, so the right axis is always pointing to the right, and the top axis would be the axis point from the center going up, away from the, up towards the sky. So that's the right and top axis. This would be how it would be set out, the default setting uh, on 1.3. So now I'm going to bring in this exploded simulated view of the IMU. As you can see from the diagram here, Y axis is going forward. So that would be positive Y, being that this is a three dimensional setup. There's a center point where all the three axes converge. <clears throat> so the, the back half of positive Y is negative Y. So X is to the right. That would be from there to the right would be positive X. And then from this side would be negative X. That little box there is the Molex connector. This is your uh, IMU itself here. This is the chipset. So, and then the Z axis would be up, positive Z would be up this way away from the board. Now if I flip it over, remember X is pointing this way. You can see now X is still this way, positive X is still this way, minus X. Since we rotated on the Y axis, Y is still this way, minus Y is still this way, and minus Z is facing this way on the bottom side of the board. So this is the way it's always on the board, no matter what. So now you're going to orient your IMU. If you were to put it this way, default setting like in 1.3, the right axis would be positive X, and the top axis, one going up towards the sky, would be plus Z. Now what if you wanted to orient it like this, sideways? So now, the axis pointing to the right would be the positive Z. You see, that axis is pointing to the right. Now, the top axis, that would be minus X. It is pointing to the top now. So that would be right axis would be plus Z, uh, and top axis would be minus X. What if you wanted it reversed with the wires coming out the back? That's pretty simple. Now to the right axis, you'd have minus X, and top axis would be plus Z. If you wanted it upside down, with the wires out the back, remember, let's rotate it this way and then flip it. So therefore, right axis would be plus X, top axis would be minus Z. Very simple, guys. Right axis and top axis is always the same, but it could be different depending on how you have the IMU oriented. Hope this helps. Ciao.